Hi everyone, happy Chew Tuesday. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. And what we have here for you, 2022 Panini Donruss Football 6 box. Hobby boxes, random team break number 5. All card ship, all teams are in. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. And there are the teams right there. The final third of the case posted in the store right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Let's roll it, randomize it. Three and a four. Seven times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, we got Connor down to Arthur King. Three and a four, seven times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. Got the Saints up top down to the Vikings. Do you think Derek Carr has Hall of Fame ability, Jeff? Hall of Fame ability? Yeah. That's what the Jets told him. That he has Hall of Fame ability? Mm -hmm. that's, that's, they're really flattering him, huh? Connor with the Saints. Sean with the Cowboys. Jared with the Chiefs. Wesley with the Broncos. Mike with the Falcons. Joe Christian. Last about Mojo. Jets. Scott with the Cardinals, Anthony with the Texans, Bennett with the Rams, Jacob with the Lions, Sean Maddock with the Seahawks, Aaron with the Bengals, James with the Bears, uh, Timothy, you got my Raiders, Sean with the Panthers, Bennett with the Packers, Glenn with the Ravens, Anthony with the Giants, Scott with the Colts, James with the Jaguars, Scott with the Titans, Joe and Dreesen with the Niners, Sean with the Steelers, Scott with the Commanders, Ryan with the Bills, Joey with the Eagles, Connor with the Chargers, Jan with the Browns, Nate with the Dolphins, Nick with the Patriots, Kevin with the Buccaneers, and Arthur King with the Vikings. There you go. All right. Let's get all this on one page. Well, it's alphabetized by team. Now, we're going to pause the video just for a little bit. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. Be right back. All right. Welcome back, everybody. No deal. A little bit of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done here on Tuesday, the uh, 21st. This is Random Team 5. The final third of the case is in the store right now. So if you want to run this back tonight, we can. Check it out. All right, so we got, uh, we got Michael here helping us out. He's going to rip open some boxes here, help us pack stack this break, make it go a little bit more quickly. We're looking for one auto, one mem per box on average. Good luck, everybody. Any uh, any crazy football news happening? I don't think so, right? Derek Carr still figuring out where he's where he's gonna go. Right guards re-signing. Colts hiring Jags. Jim Bob Cooter is a new OC. Chargers DC. Goes to the Dolphins. I think Rex Ryan going to uh, gonna interview for the Broncos defensive coordinator job. All right, I guess we're just waiting for the uh, yeah. I guess we're just waiting for the league calendar to turn over. I think March twelfth. But yeah, in a few weeks, free agency flurry will begin. I'm sure quarterback needy teams that are waiting on Derek Carr might want to see that decision get completed before uh, before they start looking at other free agents, fill out their rosters. And after free agency, there'll be there'll be the draft in April. Which I think is in Kansas City this year. All right, box one, Donner's football. Good luck. And we got a Jersey Kings, Jamar Chase, sixty-two out of one hundred. Real thick card right here. Nice. Bengals, Aaron. We're Cincinnati. We're on to Cincinnati. I think the 
these crushed fruits are not numbered. We've got Malik Willis for the Titans. Gridiron Kings for Scott. Rated rookie George Karloftis. An all card ship, just as a reminder. I've got another Bengals card coming up. And that's going to be Sam Hubbard. Your autograph is Sam Hubbard. 48 out of 50 signature marks for Aaron and Cincinnati. Cardinals edition. Michael, what are your Cardinals going to do at the quarterback position? Um, a lot of people are saying Jacoby Brissett. Uh, hmm. How long is Kyler Murray out? I, I don't know. Probably the whole season? Three quarters of the season? No, I, I don't think that long. Oh, Early, sooner? Yeah. Probably I'm hoping only like a third of the season. Maybe. Oh, that's not that bad. But AJ Dillon to 187. There's a video of him being the new head coach, and he does not look in shape. Oh. But then didn't he release another video of him just working out, grinding? Was he? I think, I think there was. I think it, it perhaps in response to that. But it looked like he was, like, walking around, so I don't know what... Let's see. That's one box right here. This is one box right yeah. here? Nice. All right, so here's box two. So Jacoby Brissett as a little stopgap and then work Kyler back into the mix. How do we feel about the new coach? Uh, I mean, the Eagles had a good season. Yeah, that's true. They went to the Super Bowl. So, uh, yeah. Kingsbury always felt like he was a little overrated coming into things anyway. Yeah. I mean, I didn't hate him as much as most people did, but... He just didn't do a good job. Yeah. What are you do? It's Mark Duper, Super Duper, 33 out of 50. And that's for Miami. That'll go to Nate, the old school Dolphin. Elite Series Malik Willis. It'll be for Scott and the Titans. Any hope for the Raiders this year? Nope. <laughs> no hope for the Raiders this year. Unless they get Aaron Rodgers. I don't think they will. Here's press proof Joe Thomas to 75 die cut. I mean, the Raiders have just have so many holes on that team. It's just really they're not like a player or two away. Yeah. They got to revamp that whole defense. They got to get depth. They got to get so many things. I think so. He, he ended the season on a pretty strong note. So yeah. they had they have him for another year or two. I want to say. This is Justin Herbert, Jersey Kings, 160 out of 399 for the Bolts. Connor with the Chargers. James, yeah, that was a rough game for uh, for, the, for Liverpool, that's for sure. Started off so promising. I don't know, Real Madrid just has just has Liverpool's number.
Isn't the uh, combine happening right now? NFL. Or is that? It's got to be happening at some point. Maybe not. Those people in the Chipotle commercials are uh, are real employees. Or do you think they're actors? <laughs> in Chipotle? In the Chipotle commercials. No, the, the one was just on. This will be randomized to one person as one lot. If there's more of these, and that's where they'll go. Or even if there's a Scott Hansen autograph. That's true. They'll probably make the employees audition. Yeah, maybe. All right, another box. We're flying through these here. If we get another one of these uh, full before in, in, within the next hour and a half or so, we probably still have Michael's help. And we'd fly through that the final third of that Donner's case. So if that motivates you, the final third, jazbeescasebreaks.com. If you're impatient. Yeah, if you're impatient. Uh, Eric Jennings, the right day to wear a Liverpool shirt because I'm supporting my club even in its darkest times. You know, not a fair weather fan, Eric Jennings. Do you keep up with soccer pretty? Yeah, pretty closely. I enjoy the sport. It's hard to hard to wake up early for Premier League yeah. games though, but My there's Skylar Thompson. Like to, uh, That's why I like Champions League because it'll be like noon noon starts oh, our yeah. time. Yeah. Skylar Thompson, Miami for Nate. Tommy's asking Chipotle his commercials. Tommy clearly not a television watcher. Have you seen the Chick Fil A commercials when they? When it's like a customer talking about like yes, I have what the employee did. Yeah, uh, I don't know how much how much of that scripted. Here's two out of ten to Kobe Dean, rated rookie. He gets a ring, right? That goes to the Eagles. That'll be for Joey. No, he doesn't get a ring. He gets an AFC ring or an NFC yeah. championship ring. Do they get rings for? Them? I have no idea. <laughs> Probably not. If they do, they probably don't even want them. No. I don't. I wonder what they do get. You think they get like a a little trophy, a little medal? Well, they get the t-shirts and the hats. The t-shirts and the hats. There's a Deontay Johnson for the Steelers. That's for Sean Maddock. There's a Najee Harris Jersey Kings. 006 out of 100. I feel like those Chick fil A ads are kind of like virtue signaling, right? Like, like look how great our employees yeah. are. They're like, you know, there's like, oh yeah, this guy and his dog was stuck out in the rain and we brought him in and gave him food and gave water to their dog or something like that. Aaron Rodgers still in his is he still in his darkness retreat? Don't know. It's the whole deal with that. Like he just sits in a house in the I, dark. I I think so. I think it's supposed to be like, hey, I'm there'd be no distractions. It's almost like a sensory deprivation chamber or something like that. Yeah. He's just gonna think on his life. There's a Kenny Pickett rated rookie going to Sean and the Steelers. boxes right here and then oh the, and the final box over there 
two more boxes, final box of the day. I don't know, but I think it's a good problem to have. I think they should. It should just be an open competition, and yeah. then whoever just plays better, you know, integrates better with the rest of the weapons. You go with that, and then the other one's just a backup, and then. You know, when the inevitable injury happens for a 49ers quarterback, like, yeah. next guy up. And it's, like, good to have either of those guys. It's Matt Corral, rated rookie. Die cut for Carolina. That'll be for Sean Robinson. Different Sean. And we got Power Plus, Leonard Fournette. Buccaneers. Buccaneers have to figure out what to do at the quarterback. They have Kyle Trask. They have Kyle Trask. It's true. What else do they need? That's, I, that's it, I guess. He's been marinating behind Brady for a couple seasons. He's probably learned a lot. Leonard Fournette for the Buccaneers. That'll go to Kevin. Do you think the Packers is still with Jordan Love? I think so. Give him a chance. I think you have to. Right? Give him a full season, yeah. if, especially if Rodgers doesn't come back. Just be like, hey, let's do a full training camp, full summer. You know, let's – you get all the first-team reps – you know, the coach has been the same, right? So that playbook's got to be the same. So he should have that memorized front front and back, right? So he should be, should be able to do everything. It's just a matter of getting the reps in. Let's see what happens. He played a little bit last year. And he looked pretty decent. Yeah, he did. It'd be good for the hobby. It'd be very good for the hobby. And I, you know what? I think they, I think the Buccaneers might just go with Kyle Trask too. Yeah. Just can't take it for the Steelers. Because I think, I think even with Brady's retirement, they've got a big cap hit. That's what I think I saw on the interwebs. So they might not be in the market for like, let's go get Derek Carr yeah. and add another $30 million. So they may just be like, let's just see, because Trash can know the playbook inside and out, and he's learned behind Brady. Yeah. So, I mean, let's give him a season to, to figure it out. Yeah, Eric, I don't know. That's the big question in Raider Nation. Who's going to be the Raiders quarterback? I don't. I think it should be Jared Siddham, actually. Just get Jared Siddham in there. You know, and then you can still draft a quarterback in, like, the mid-rounds or something like that. Yeah. There's been some crazy talk about the Raiders trading up to the number one pick, which, which I don't know. I don't know about that. Oh, nice. Thank you, Michael. Appreciate it. Here's a, uh, oh. <laughs> sorry, sorry, Mitch. Did you think it was I was gonna, it's gonna be a picket for a second there. But I don't know. It's a big decision for the Raiders, though. I think it's gonna be uh, a really important one, obviously, because you don't get all those weapons. You don't re-sign Josh Jacobs. You don't give Darren Waller, Hunter Renfro, Max Crosby, Devonte Adams all those. Give them all that money. Here's Romeo Dobbs, 32 out of 50. For the Texans, here's Rex Burkhead to 427. Yeah, 427, that's kind of weird. I don't understand the number. True, QB could fall. To, uh, yeah, I'm hearing more chatter about the Bears trading that first overall pick, but I'm also hearing chatter about should they trade Justin Fields? And they take a quarterback with the number one pick. There's a press proof Kenny Pickett for Sean Maddock. And another Mark Andrews for Glenn and the Ravens. Another Rally 56 out of uh, three, 390, 399. Like almost unnecessarily thick at 399. It makes me think it's like gonna be out of 10. And it's like, oh. What pick do the Raiders have? Seven, I believe. 
Yeah. Like some, some people are saying they shouldn't have to trade up and they can go with the Tennessee quarterback, I think, who went down with that ACL injury but should be ready for... I hate when they do that. It makes you think, oh, is that an auto? Nope. Here's Brock Purdy, though. Rated rookie card for Joe Andreessen in the Niners. Yeah, it could be... Anthony Richardson's the Kentucky guy, I think? Or is that Will Levis? I don't know. Yeah, but there's a lot of quarterbacks available. They're looking at the maybe the... Who's the Tennessee quarterback? Hooker? Hendon Hook? Someone yeah, Hooker? I think so, yeah. I think so, nice. People love the idea of having a Hooker in Vegas for the Raiders. So that kind of fits. Richardson's Florida. Levis is Kentucky. There we go. Thank you, David. So yeah, I mean, there's a lot, lot of options for the Raiders, and I, I don't, I don't know if we'll really know until there's an autograph. That's Bailey Zappi, 57 out of 1. I feel I know some fans of the Patriots want this guy over Mac Jones. Nice. And the final box coming up. Good luck, everybody. So, yeah, Raiders could take, could keep Jared Stidham, still take a quarterback in the first round or later rounds. They could trade up, get a different quarterback, roll with, roll with that quarterback. They could get Jimmy G and keep Jared Stidham. They could try to trade for Aaron Rodgers. Cordell Patterson to 84. Who knows? Malik Willis rated rookie for Scott. Two one of ones were pulled from the store yesterday. Really? Aaron Judge one of one out of series one. Someone got an Aaron Judge one of one out of series one? Wow. How many boxes does this person buy? One out of one. Just one? Yeah. And just got the one of one? And, they're, and he's like, probably, that's it, I'm done. It was a kid. It was a kid? Yeah. Wow. And then, uh, Good for the kid. Someone bought an F1 top scroll out of box, but was super fragile. The French guy? No. Oh. no. Those, French, those, those two French guys are always coming in here buying yeah. the F1. <laughs> they're going to be bummed. Here's Kellen Winslow. 199 chargers. The French hair was just here. Oh, it was an 88 throwback one. It's still, still pretty nice. Did you see it happen? Is the kid going nuts? Uh, they posted it on Instagram. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Nice. Cause you know, like the series one, like one of ones, they're just like a gray border. Yeah, it's just, it's kind of sneaky. Yeah, he had no idea, and then he turned around. He's like, oh my god. Must be so happy. Alright gang, I think, I don't know what I'm looking for here. Are we looking for an autograph? Yes, nice, Desmond Ritter. 20 out of 49. For the Falcons, Mike Cass with Atlanta. Is he the guy in the ATL? I think so. I think they'll keep going with him. I thought so. 20 out of 49. Nice auto. I think that's it. Would have picked Sky Moore anytime touchdown. <laughs> Would have saved my day.
and Scott Hansen, fans of the game autograph. We we're just talking about how we would randomize this to one person in the break. Uh, there's two autos in one box. Yeah, there was. Nice. I always love the hate he gets on Twitter. Like, he's doing Red Zone, and then yeah. it's like, Red Zone coverage is over, but you can tune in on CBS to catch the end of this game. And then, it, but it's all regional, so, yeah, like, yeah. so there are some regions that don't get the game. It's like, what the F? What the F, Scott Hansen? I love Scott Hansen. He's pretty good. All right, let's uh, flip back to the list over here. Let's gather all the names. Name on top will, after the dice roll, name on top will get the auto and the two other... Scott Hansen, fans of the game card. One out of four, five times. Name on top after five. Good luck. One, two, three, four, and five. After five, Mike. There you go. Got the Desmond Ritter, and you got the Scott Hansen. And those two cards right there. So congrats to you. Quick little recap. Pretty nice break. Final third of the case in the store now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Get in on it, and we can run it back tonight. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.